Hey everybody, how are you doing this morning? I'm going to read this little passage that I um, wrote. Uh, actually just kind of came up with it this morning. Um, December 20, 2018. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm calling this uh, The Call of the Wolf Moon Rising. As a society, this country is in trouble. Most people are tired, lethargic, and unable to willfully mandate their lives towards a higher goal because they are tired. So frustration mounts. Everyone desires a more meaningful life. They want more time for the things that matter. Family, community, and the intergenerational transference of wisdom. To say nothing about the possibility of reaching one's potential. Alas, Time seems to slip away each day, each week, each moment, without us ever finding a way to fulfill these greater needs. That is up till now. We are preparing to enter an era in 2021 where we will be challenged to reach for this reality. We are told by the Mayans, the Egyptians, the Siberians, and the Inuits, among others, by the way, that the coming period will bring instability and challenges. Yet, through this disharmony, we as a human family will be made to work through our differences and discover one path forward. For each human being born to this era, for each man, woman, and child asserting their humanness within this era, will come a fanciful mood to dissect society uh, into plague-stricken uh, factions. Yet to each man, woman, and child, to each man, woman, and child's credit, so too will rise a determining will force, navigating each towards the other, forging new bonds with new realities attached. If we fail to capitalize on this potential, new fissures can erupt within human consciousness, completely severing the whole human tree from the fertile grounds of cosmic consciousness, throwing the planet into a tailspin till it crashes into the abyss, annihilating all life for millennial to come, or for millennia to come. If we do not give in to our baser desires, then the world will be renewed, healing itself miraculously from the harm inflicted upon its soul, bringing together our tattered souls in the process. Will we ready ourselves to fulfill this new destiny, or will we continue to live as half men, half women, half children? Thank you. Hope you enjoyed it.